Interviews for the position of the director of the Directorate of Criminal Investigations held yesterday by the National Police Service Commission saw 10 candidates shortlisted and interviewed for the position. The list had very able, very competent applicants and the best of all uh, whom we still don't know up to now uh, will be known perhaps when we have finished the exercise. Today three names were forwarded to the president and are awaiting deliberation and further guidance. The president has powers to nominate one among the three or reject both. If all the three are rejected, the National Police Service Commission will have to schedule new interviews for the same. If the president nominates one among the three, the nominee will undergo vetting process in the parliament before being sworn in as the 16th director of the DCI. The president has until Friday to pronounce himself on the matter, following the period of 14 days since the resignation of former director DCI George Kinoti. The three recommended for the position of the DCI boss are Amin Ibrahim Mohamed, Gideon Nyale Munga, and David Kipkos Gay Birech. Gideon Nyale Munga is a seasoned detective and currently the principal assistant to the Inspector General of the National Police Service. Previously, he headed the dreaded Flying Squad Unit, as well as the Anti-Terror Police Unit. <laughs> Amin Ibrahim Mohammed, also a detective, is the current Director Internal Affairs Unit within the National Police Service. I'm one of the candidates having been shortlisted to come and uh, attend the interview for the DCI. And I'm glad that I was given this opportunity to attend the interview and uh, answer the questions posed to me by the panel to the best of my ability, to the best of my knowledge, and to the best of my competence. Previously, Amin Mohammed has headed the Investigations Bureau at the DCI and the Banking Fraud Unit. The third name forwarded to the president is that of David Kipkosgei Birech. David Birech is currently head of police reforms. Tonight, the president will be making deliberations on what next to the three names before the Friday deadline. Franklin Walla, K24 TV.